walk forward, walk in. And away we go. So very much of a muchness, this heat. Two's turning at the top, Pete's going nicely. Uh, over there is Eleanor. Eleanor. So to the tire and on the way back and on the far side, Eleanor's going very nicely. Little lifters for heat two. Nice fish out for Pete and Greg and the blue of Emma. A bit of an overshoot for Pete and oh dear, John has come out the side door. So it's Greg leading the way, but also Alan is going very smoothly too. Pete on his way back now. George a bit of an overshoot. But here comes the final placement, and it's a good one for Greg. And first into the saddle on the way back is John, but uh, slightly smoother turn by Greg next to him. Oh dear. Where are you going, Emma? Do come back. Ah, but so John manages to do it. Right, here we go. And first Ben was Eleanor, but Greg's working very hard. And so is George. It's Eleanor. Dan. Oh, Pete. Pete's knocked his bucket over. You silly boy. Eleanor is really going nicely, but it's Greg, definitely, who's overcome the uh, problem with the start. And right, away we go. Oh, Pete. Okay. Unfortunately, I think the lack of sleep has been so noble. It's Eleanor. Eleanor from Greg. Turning nicely. Poor little stumble on the far side for Greg's pony, which is absolutely flying down towards the line. It's but after a slight discussion, shall we say, between the riders and the referee as to who's actually starting the race. They've agreed that Davey is starting the race and Bradley is uh, looking like he's on rails. Obviously good at used to making trips to the bank. So this race is a little bit outdated really. When was the last time you went to a bank for anything? Everything done by bank transfer these days. So coming over, a mile in front of everybody else is James. Here comes Bradley. Not exactly racing anymore, are we? Then there's Greg going very slowly. Oh, we've got a bit of a race on this time. And coming down, it is going to be... Bradley takes that one. And we've got rings mostly on. Right, so turning first and going back up, it is... Uh, Bradley, over on the far side, we've got James and we've got Greg. Danny is giving a running commentary that's louder than mine. So Bradley takes that one for. And 
a nice start, nice level start. And away we go, but we've got a problem there. James is So, nice start. So, the reds are down. Now, first to ten. There's nothing much to tell between any of them. Possibly Bradley. And I think Craig. Oh, we've got a problem in lane one for... Uh, Simon. Our final placement and they're coming down. It's going to be correct. Lovely level start. Right, and turning. I'll tell you what, I'm glad I don't have this one, sir. The way that Bradley held that pushed body to the ground. Bradley, Helena. Fourth Dave and Mitch. Molly's having a lovely little trot. But heading to the top, it looks to be John, I would say. John, Mitch and Sades. Sienna on the inside. Peter is motoring in the centre with Greg and Molly a little bit behind. Molly's probably just going to cant around this popper flag and be on the way back up. But it's Peter breaks first. Peter just from Sades, Mitch, Molly has done a good job. She's en route with Sienna. Coming down with the second flag, it looks to be Peter, Sades and Mitch. They're all coming at an angle like they're going home, concerns me. Going back up with the next one, good put in again for Peter. He's been practicing this. Mitch and Sades hot on their, his, his heels. Greg's en route now and Sienna a bit slower for Molly that time. Come on, Molly line. John's going well on the far side, but it's Peter with the last placement. A little bit of reversing. But Sades takes the race here. She sneaks through and nicks the points as per. Overcomes Peter. Oh no. Not starting over well, but they may all miss, Molly. We all might be good. Yep, there's one down. Well, two down in the same lane. Another one down. More down. There's literally no one got this right. Apart from John and Greg. John, wow! John, I did say you were pretty good at level break. Wee oui, man, that was excellent. You might want to be a bit careful because I think Mitch is coming down here, David. Like here. <laughs> we're heading down the ring, it's Mitch and John. John is in the saddle. Whoa! Spots last week, I could do what I like. Right, we're moving on. <laughs> As we're heading to the top. Unfortunately, there's a miss for Peter on the far side. Greg is shouting, whoa. A very different tactic. All flags are going it upside down. All right, heading round for the last one. There are five, six in a line. Go on, Molly. Go, Molly. Yeah, oh, nearly. Sade takes that. Just... level break, David. They're all in a line, heading up. Sades is pootling. So, turning at the top, bit of a slip Greg. for Whisper, unfortunately, knocks the mug off. Greg, that was really unlucky. So, leading the way, it is Mitch and Molly. Molly, Vinnie is absolutely motoring in lane one. Slight overshoot on the turn, but I think it's going to be Mitch. Mitch is going to take that one. Molly, great run on the inside. I said I wanted seven, you got six. That's pretty good. Over comes John, Peter, Sienna, Sades, is out for an afternoon canter. Nessa's still having a lovely time, but wondering why she didn't go fast enough. If Mrs. Locke had done... 
I'll tell you the rest of the semi-final two semi-finalists in a minute. Old James has made a porridge of it, and so indeed has Mitch, which is most un-Mitch-like. He's got the cone over, and in fact we've got some of them on the way back, but roaring through on the inside is Bradley. But Bradley takes that from Mike. Oh, James! Right, we're away. One, two, two, and three, two, four. John's flying on the far side. And everybody else going really nicely. Here we come on the way back. And this is where it really counts. And it's John. John takes the cruise over the line. Eleanor's had to... And this is also for a padded lead rope. Oh, interesting. Eleanor, you see, picked it up off the floor. I didn't see what Mitch did, but it's Mitch and Eleanor and John in a line. Those three. Now, Mitch stays on and Eleanor stays on. And John gets off. Oh, oh, they both went for it. Eleanor got it. Mitch did. Good shot. Bradley's bottle's gone over. On oh, James's bottle's on the ground. Roaring through there, it's Mitch. Right, they're away. Great place for top of the top by everybody. Oh, the brakes are going on for Bradley. Oh. Comes first and second. Then Catherine hasn't got it. Right, okay. Here comes Mitch down for the final placement. And oh. Score with 41 points. Well done, Mitch. In the blue shirt. Now we had a tie between Sadie and uh, Greg. And um, we normally do these things on alphabetical things. So Greg will be in blue. Victor 23 riding for Chuko. He comes from Canterbury and Kent. He rides for Shots of South in the NBA. And he'd like to thank Immy for being a pro trainer and manager. What can we say about this? I mean, he's been there, done it, won the t shirt. Give a daddy the t-shirt. Martin, Amber, they do a great job around here as well. Good luck, Mitch. We're all reaching for you. Coming in in second, another one that's been around for years, but it still says he's only 21. In the blue is Greg James. Hello, Greg, riding the lovely whisper. Greg from Osborne Street, Shropshire. He rides to Cowish in the NBA. He was a semi-finalist last year. Mitch will be riding for England again this summer. Greg is also going out to Europeans this summer with England. Good luck, Greg. In the yellow, here she is, in her yellow, familiar colours. Baby lot, baby lot. Start for Mitch and Bradley. John as well in the purple going well. They're heading for the top. Who's going inside? Who's outside? Bradley's done a great inside turn there. He knows he's got to do well in high-low, I reckon. Greg with a great turn round there. Saves is going well, Mitch is going well on the inside, unfortunately the cone's gone over for George. But coming down for the final ball, it is going to be Bradley. I think Bradley's going to take that jump from Mitch. Oh, I think Davey had a chat, there was no need for any of that. Start for Mitch, obviously, everybody else in a line, I think that was fair. Right, we're heading to the top, Bradley is really going for it and throwing himself at those pillows. Saves is absolutely flying, but I would say Mitch is going really well. Mitch is flying back up there, Bradley stays going well in third, Catherine, Greg, George and jo John on the far side, but it's going to be Bradley again, I think so, get that in your mouth, she's jumping on, here comes Bradley and Mitch, really close, whoa, that was so close, I reckon Mitch just took it from start that time, that was a fairer start, heading up through the poles, I think it's probably just the yellow of Sage, Bradley is flying though, Mitch is going really well, it's Sage in the lead, Nessa is motoring through those poles, she takes that by a country mile from you. Here we go with triple fly, great start there, good level break, everybody was behaving, heading to the top and turning. Coming down with the first flag, who's got the steadiest hand? Great break for Greg, Greg is absolutely flying. Unfortunately there's a flag out for Catherine, so she's got to go back. But it's definitely Greg leading the way, he's done an inside turn around there. 
John Mitch and Bradley all level in second place space and George right behind that we're coming with the second flag it's in for Mitch Mitch heads up for his third flag up goes Greg up goes Bradley Sace is right behind them Catherine needs a bit of remounting she's on board now John's going up for his last flag as well but coming down with the final flag the red flag white red there's loads of them here Greg breaks for the line Greg takes up oh great level break again this is getting better and better these starts Socks are in the bucket. Jumpy off at the top on the far side. Unfortunately, slight overshoot saves, but she's in the saddle. John's overshot the bucket. Mitch has overshot the bucket. Bradley's absolutely flying on the inside. George is going well. Mitch is back in the game now. Greg's going well. Saves on the far side. But coming down with the final stop, it looks to be Bradley. I reckon Bradley. Oh, just from Mitch. Followed by... Bit of a crazy start there, but we're heading up to the top. Oh, Saves, you were flying there. So the... First box is on, unfortunately, there's only one on the floor for George, but we're heading round now. It looks to be Sage, Bradley, John, Mitch, Catherine and Greg, all in a line. I would say Mitch and Sage just in head of everybody else. Bradley is skimming the paint off the bins, but Nessa is absolutely motoring on the inside. Chico's motoring on the far side. It is now Sage and Mitch coming down with the last box. Is there just ahead? Catherine's going well in the centre, John is motoring down, great pace for Sage, she's taken that. A great start for Bradley, Sage and Mitch and Greg, these four are the ones we're here to watch at the moment. Bradley's having a few issues getting around the bin but I reckon Sage and Ness are taking it up. She's coming for the line, it's Sage takes that from Bradley. Then we're away, that was a pretty good level break, we'll turn Lady Gaga up slightly. Turning first, I think it's Sage in the yellow. Mitch has a slight stumble, Bradley's going inside for the pickup, so he is going really well as well in lane four, but Greg's flying too, these four on the inside, they're right up there, Bradley's gone on another inside turn, I reckon he might be taking this up, but Sage and Nessa are heading for the line, Bradley takes that, a great level break, Davey, you're keeping him going really well here, heading to the top with the first flag, everybody is flying, Mitch is going really well in the red, I'd say it's just Mitch, Bradley's doing an inside turn, but oh, unfortunately he's missed the flag, so, it's Mitch and Sage and Greg coming down for the last flag. Mitch and Sage and Greg, they're in a line here. I think Sage is going to take that one from Greg. From Great start. Bradley had a good start. He is literally pushing Rolex to the limit. Oh, unfortunately, there is a cone over coming down the centre. I think we know who's the winner. Great finish. Bradley takes that race, but Mitch came in second. Catherine with a good third place. Here comes Lacey's in fourth place on 45 points. Greg James in the blue. Greg will be getting himself ready for the European on Whisper. The individuals. <laughs> 2018, I think he came pretty close last year. The year before. <laughs> well done, Mitch. On a massive 56 points, Mitch, you were brilliant in there. Didn't score under four in any way, except from one, you got a four in. Everything else. When it was the Midland individual period. You've got a yellow one. <laughs> You've all got a skin in your bucket. You do a bit of advertising for us. Bradley, I hope you've got a skin the same size as mine. <laughs> Things start going a bit south when you're a bit old. <laughs> <laughs> Mitch, I think you better keep those lucky boots on, to be honest, if you can't. <laughs> <And Belgium. laughs>